Folks, welcome back to the 7th Annual Raid the Cell Memorial Nine Ball Tournament. Combined with the Josh Northeast Nine Ball Tour, I'm Upstate Al of AZB TV. We're coming to you live from Snookers. We've been here for the last three days. We're down to our final two players. We'll introduce them to you right now. The gentleman in the hot seat is Mr. Sean Wilkie. The gentleman coming from the B-side is Jason Shaw. This is a true double elimination tournament. Jason will have to beat Sean two times in the finals. But if Sean should win the first set, it's over, and he is the champion of the Raid the Cell Memorial Nine Ball Tournament. Before we actually get started and underway, you know, Molinari's been up there and uh, staging things for AZB TV and supporting you guys out in the chat and giving away a lot of gloves through the years. We're going to throw Molinari glove up there, guys, and uh, if you're in the market, you know these players are playing with them. Uh, proof is in the pudding. Uh, Jason Shore has one on, and he travels the world. They have built to last. MolinariGlove.com. Get yours right there. We keep mentioning this new device, and believe me when I tell you, you put it on your thumb, it fits everybody's finger. If you use an open bridge, you're going to make more balls with it. It holds your cue stick steady. There is movement when you don't have one until you train yourself. Check it out. Go there. Fingerbridge.com. And Joel, this man right here from Florida, you can buy this tip tool. You'll never have to buy another one. They come in nickel radius, dime radius, and pro taper. They're billet aluminum. They're very lightweight. Lastforever.com with the number four in the address. Mention Upstate Al 20, and you're going to receive 20% discount. I mean, you know, these guys are bending over backwards. They do want to sell their product. Yes, 20% off during the live stream. You have it right there. It's lastforever.com with the number four. This gentleman right here, Mr. Greg Antonakis, uh, can't say anything bad about him, but get in touch with Greg for your Southwest at GA9Ball at gmail.com. That's GA9Ball at gmail.com for your Southwest. We're going to be at the Turning Stone August 25th through the 28th. 128 strong right now with two-thirds of the way full. If you want to play at the Turning Stone, Mike? if you want to play at the Turning Stone, get in touch with Mike Zuglin right away because it is a Moscone Point ranked tournament. These players are ready to rock and roll. I want to thank everybody, uh, including AccuStats, who I always thank. It's AccuStats.com. And don't forget, the Jazz Man is always hanging out with us. Make sure to follow the Jazz Man on YouTube. Jarrett Arasamina, the Jazz Man. Gives Kenny G the four out and the snap. Jason broke the balls. Try that all out. Simona's cloth, the only cloth to use throughout the world is Simona's cloth. And of course, Upstate Al is AZB TV. Okay, and we're going to have Kevin come on the air. He's a retired altar boy. Yes. He's going to keep it nice and cool. That's he cool. definitely uh, he likes the action, and he likes to put a couple of whatever it is on the side and bet on matches. Jason said, hey, you want some more of that action? And he said, no, I got mine already. So Jason put the hammer on him. Oh, uh, <laughs> go Al, ahead, Kev. Al, it, um, <laughs> go ahead, Kev. Hit me with it. Honestly, Al, it's tough to be that guy in the room. And uh, <laughs> You I, are that guy. Though. I know, I know. I understand that. But I, I, I've known Sean for a long time, and uh, I respect this game. And I, I think he's going to bring it in this set. So uh, I think Jason was just coming off of a couple matches where uh, – he really, he really felt my presence with the with with rooting against him, especially in the last set against the Shane, because uh, I am from Providence and I am gonna root for him in the local room. But uh, 
Jason Shaw is a world world champion. He's a he's a world class man, and uh, there's no disrespect between me and him. Between no, you guys are friends. It's yeah, not, absolutely. It's not the first rodeo. And uh, I, I, did you? It, it, Sean just missed the one right there. He was trying to thin it right in the corner, and he gave Jay Paul in the hand. He's looking at the angle on a three, but that's tight past the five. I don't know. He, he, obviously, Eagle Eye sees it. That's a strong shot. He comes down bottom table right behind the three. A little straight, but... He's looking at it. He don't like it. Al, it's been a while since I've seen you. Since the last uh, Eastern... Since the parking lot. Well, yeah. Well, we've seen was... the sun come up. Yeah, that was the uh, that was the Eastern... Eastern... Eastern State Tour by Tony yeah. Robles. Yeah, with uh, the Predator Tour. Or he hit it pretty strong, but I, I don't know. The eight might be in the game there, Al. I don't know. Take a look at that. And, uh, What's that? The eight might be in the game? I think it is. I think he's going to have to swerve around it or something. It's in the game, but he might be able to curve it, like you said, and get yeah. the cushion first. Yeah. Yep. That's what he did. Wow, look at that four spin. Comes all the way four rails and he gets great on the five. Wow, what a shot from Jay right there. That was real strong. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I got my producer here on my left-hand side navigating the show and i texting and I'm trying to update the computer. So forgive me. We're getting into the match right now, Kev. Swing it, no, Daddy. No, no. Who, you, who did you pick in this match? That's I, I, well, I, you went I, with Shaw. No, I didn't. I, uh, you like with, I said, I've known, known I've known Sean for a long time, and right. uh, uh, hey, so did I. Uh, every, uh, so do I. Yeah. Everybody else in the room wants. He's wants shooting Jason and breaking good, going. isn't he? The, the kid gets out from everywhere when You're he right. gets a chance at the table, and that's why I was surprised where when he when he when he shaved the one, he didn't he didn't hit it and gave Jay ball in hand, and uh, Shaw's out. Oh, so Shaw's we'll out right here. Oh, absolutely. First game is always a uh, always a swing game, but we'll see. I I, I like I like Sean in the long run. I've known Sean uh, many many years. He made a lot of money with Sean. Me too. Yeah, down at the expo, you probably Absolutely. been down here. Yeah. That's why I first met him when he was wearing a uh, or a Baltimore Colts jersey. Uh, uh, Edgerin James was the was the 32 was the number, and I even gave him gave him something about it last night when I saw him with a Denver Broncos hat on. I said, you change affiliations? And he was like, oh, no, I'm just a Peyton Manning fan. And now up here, I, I don't know if you know, we're all Patriots. We love Tom Brady. Yeah, and I understand every time you guys bet on them, um, they win. <laughs> Is that what happens? <laughs> usually. Usually, Al. Unless they're playing the Giants. <laughs> uh, so... Jaws on a rack, he's taking a look at it. He's he's making Sean do it again. Sorry about that. Some everybody keeps texting into the booth here. Uh, getting me off the match. Oh, we're back to the rack. Yeah, he he, he questioned it. So Sean's gonna do it again. I've played on that table and it kind of rocks back. So you almost have to push it before the dot to make it settle. Tough table. He got it good there. I want to thank everybody out there, uh, especially Foxy Blue. She's been helping out so much. It's uh, behind the scenes more than what anybody probably knows. I want to thank Foxy uh, for doing everything she does. And, of course, Jarrett and all our mods and everybody for signing in we do appreciate the support we know that you guys want to do we just you would want to see this match anyway you see the chat right there what about it they're asking about shaw's shoes yeah 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 they're comfortable man they What's look like got? nikes aren't they i don't know it looks that's like an nikes. interesting question though i seen that come up there that's that's uh that's 
Well, you know what? We usually get Jason in the booth uh, at one time or another. We can always pop that question at him. Here he is on the snap. Right? Quite well. He went dry in the first break, and I think he's dry here. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, got caught up in the chat. I really want to step out for a couple of minutes if you guys will enjoy this for a little while. I just need a couple of minutes to, uh, I got to get water and wash my face. I'm kind of I'll do you falling think. out. Would you mind sitting in? I Don't will. say a swear word. Oh, They'll yeah. text me right away. I'll come back here. You I'll will. put you in handcuffs and I'll drag you out the door. Well, <laughs> hey, I already submit, sir. <laughs> Kevin's beautiful. You got to love him. You got to meet this guy when you get here. Well, thanks, Tip. Thank you so much, Tip, for helping out. I'll be right back, guys. Al's, Al's going to step aside and give me the give me the keys to the castle here? Got it. All right. Well, if you're expecting a promo, no, no, don't touch it. I'm sorry. I'm not going to hit any buttons. But if you listen to the live stream, Al's going to take a break. He's going to get a drink. He's going to have some fun. Jay's looking here at the two in the side. Oh, actually, the one all the way up. When he tried to hide it behind the seven ball, and I think he did a pretty nice job there. What's going on, bro? Yeah, right, come on, man. Sean's taking a look at this shot here. Uh, I don't know what you see, but I see a, at least a two-rail kick. Or He's taking a look straight past the seven, but I don't, I don't think he can pocket that ball. Nobody could thin it, and now he's going to hide right back behind the seven. It's a good shot from Sean. Put him back down the table. Shaw's back up now here, leading one nothing. Taking a look at the one. I don't know. What do you play here? I mean, the, the three's cutting off a lot of that one. I don't think he can even make a look at the one nine. But he tried it anyway. It's Kevin, right? It is Kevin. Hey, Steve. Nice to meet you. Steve, pleasure. Yeah, we have met on the floor over here playing around our... Uh, yeah, yeah. Round table eight, but uh, that's right. Oh, Sean's, Sean's just gonna bump it up here and freeze him on the five. That's fine. Now Jay's gonna take a look. Up one, nothing. Right. Gonna kick it right down the table. All right, left him wide open. Good play by uh, Wilkie there. Now he's got a good look at the one here. Hey, he's looking at coming back, drawing it, or spinning it to where he can play the two on his side. Yeah, he he said not to touch anything or not to. Can you hear me in the No, I can't. So you have to hit something here. Yeah, I think I think we need John. We need John. Yeah. Oh, and Sean just had a good shot there. He drew straight back to play the testing, two on the side. Testing, testing. That's a good test right there, bro. Can you hear me? Yeah, you're in. You, can you hear me now? Yeah, you're loud, man. All right, cool. If I'm too loud, everybody tell me. I'll... No, I think you're good. Very good. I wish we could uh, repeat or at least uh, respond to some of the chat messages that uh, uh, that Upstate Al's getting. But, uh, let me see what I can do here. I'm not much with computers. There, see? I already ruined it. <laughs> it's like I'm, let's not dig ourselves too deep of a hole there. Yeah. <laughs> he comes back like it's not even on the stream yeah, anymore. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we're, we're, we're here in a one nothing match and he comes back and it's like <laughs> 10 nothing and uh, there's there's different names on the board. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no. We got we got Sean here up on the three ball. Looks like he's going to play. Play it in the corner and come right two rails for the four. Got a good little kiss there off the eight. 
boy, Wilkie's a good player. Oh, man. Like I said with Al, I met him a long time ago down at the Expo with, uh, with uh, Alan Hopkins. And uh, the kid was just great on the bar box. And I always... I always had an affinity for the way he got out. He just, yeah. He just was a he was a persistent grinder. He never gave up on a shot. So I, when he comes to my hometown, like I haven't seen him. He's from Baltimore, right? We're and now good. now he's up in the Northeast, and he, he's still. I mean, no matter where you go, there's a good pool room, and this kid shoots good pool, and he's made it all the way to the final hot seat match. Wins the hot seat match against Jason, and now he's got a shot at winning the tournament. And he has a really good fashion sense with these 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 sneakers are. I didn't like, like the it. hat. Did you see him with the hat? It's the sneakers. Well, the sneakers are cool. They're awesome. I don't like the hat. Well. Well, we'll talk about it later. I don't have to talk to Sean. And he got right behind the six there. What a shot. Yep. He's right in line here on the Brooklyn side of it. Well, Brooklyn, we all play bowling, right? That's we right. bowl. Yeah. Uh, it's always sometimes when you miss it's good to hit Brooklyn. That's right. And then when you hit one or two, it feels stronger. That's right. Yeah. Well well Sean here, I think he's gonna play the six all the way up. He's looking at oh, it. He's gonna play it off the eight and He's side. looking to play it off the eight and the side. But these pockets here, honestly, I played these pockets here at Snookers. They're not that forgiving. So to, it must to, not go in the corner for him to even look at that. I mean, why not well, just play it in the corner? That's right what angle? I'm thinking. Good observation there, man, because because he really is taking a long look at this. Unless he's, you know, trying to keep Jason sitting. Yep, he did try to play it off the eight. I can't believe it didn't go by, but I mean, we only have the monitor to look at. The angle could be a little different. Jason's back at the table here with a good look to go up 2 0. Oh. Al's yeah. back. Yeah. Al. Back in the box. What Steve, happened? you have a safe trip, man. I'll see you again down the road somewhere. <laughs> right, yeah. Jason Shore. Okay, let's crank this up a little bit. There we go. Jason Shore up at the table. He likes back cutting. So he's going to probably back cut the six ball. Yeah, I made it. And long distance doesn't really mean much to Jason or Mike for that fact. I mean, they both fire balls from long distance. But with these pockets, you got to make sure you hit them right in the jaws. And he's got to draw back for the eight. Beautiful shot. Yeah, Jason's having fun right now. The reason I mentioned Mike, because Mike DeShane, he fires him in just as well from long distance. All right, uh, what's the score here anyway? Two nothing now if he sends that. Oh, okay, so the score has been put up. Yeah, it's a good shot. Two nothing, Mr. Jason Shaw. Hey, silky smooth. There's not, a, there's not a shot on the table he doesn't make. We were talking earlier, Al. Yeah. And we were saying, ah, oh, this this pool player has a gear. Well, this guy can 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 kick it in, and he can win a few sets. He can win a few games. Right. And then when Jason Shaw's name came up, it was like he invented a gear. Oh yeah, he's got his own like, gear. Yeah, like that's without a doubt. That kind of player, like where he steps it up, where there is just there's nobody that can compete with that gear. Wow, I'm talking yeah. about hitting him. He's come up dry in his all three breaks, I think. Al. Yeah, he he's been hitting him hard and coming up dry. Maybe he's got to tone it down a little bit because he just shattered the eight ball into powder. I mean, you know, <laughs> look at this. Wilkie going behind a little the safe. back to try to duck him behind the seven. He gave him a peek, but don't be surprised if Jason tries the three ball here. Right. You know. It's a one pocket shot. Or he'll just roll up and play a safe. 
coming all the way down table. What's he doing? He's, he's yeah, coming, coming up down table. Yeah. And he got him pretty good. Well, he might have left the window between the, 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 the eight ball and the two to get, at least hit a one rail kick. Or kick the one down. Yeah, yeah, the nine one rail. It. He's got to be careful. You know, he's kicking that. If he kicks the one square, I like kicking it towards the side pocket. Kicking the one towards right. the right side pocket to come back down. If you kick it too square, it's going to come down where the nine is. Could make a difference here. And so, Sean's down 2 nothing. so this is a big shot. Like, here in the match, because... Man, he did go for the nine. Well, he went in that direction, yeah. Oh, he he, he, uh, he, he attempted to make that nine. Well, he hit it with enough speed so that it, if it comes down there, it'll knock the nine out or at least bounce back out instead of leaving the one nine wired, you know, for a combination. Right. So he hit it with good speed. I thought he was hunting it. Well, hit it with good speed. It could have had the possibilities of definitely making it. Came out all right so far. Hey, didn't change it like that one. Someone comes up. Down to nothing. I don't know. What is your mentality when you're down to nothing to a to a to a world champion? Do you you, you gotta keep you mean, to, right? to, you mean to somebody of Jason's caliber? Yeah. Well, you just gotta stay in the game. Sean Wilkie's been in this position before. He's, of course. You know, he's seasoned. He's not gonna let that bother him. He's just gonna go one game at a time. You know, and this is what I gotta do. Uh, I gotta beat this guy this one set, and I'm the uh, champion of the Ray DeSalvo Lawrence tournament. He got a pretty good hit there. I think he got a piece and roll. Nah, now, now Jason's pretty open there. Four well, the balls. four ball, yeah, yeah and always... the seven. The seven goes if he gets the cue ball in the area where it is now. Uh, the four ball is going to be a little tough here. He looks calm. He looks real calm. Two, to get the angle on the three. The four is what do you uh Yeah, that, I think that's the, that's the ball game, right? I mean, to get to the, at least even to solve the seven ball. Look, look, at, look at this pinpoint position that he wants he's, to play. Now, either he wants to play it or he's going to drag the rock. He might play that position or drag the cue ball behind it between the eight. Drag the cue yeah. right into the eight. Uh, well, now he now he's gonna have to play safe. Yeah. Didn't take long. He already knew what he was gonna play. So he well, he took a look to see yeah. if the four eight were wired. See right. if the eight went in, he would have played the yeah, eight. He ball. didn't take long. So he, he knew. Took, took a look at it. Stick Sean again behind the six and still controlling the rack. Kevin. There. He's got a French last name, right? Brule. Brule. Kevin Brule. Brule is in the chat. <laughs> you know how many people I mean, I can't remember all Oh, I know. I, I feel embarrassed, but with you, I don't get embarrassed because I know you forgive me. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Brule is in the uh, chat. I mean, in the commentator's booth with Upstate. Uh, local here, nice gentleman. Spent many hours. <laughs> when the first night I met Kevin, I think we stayed out in the parking lot until the sun came up. Huh? Just I've, shooting the breeze. I've been friends since. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Now Sean's looking to kick at it. Uh, one rail? The way he's looking at yeah, it. Yeah, one rail, and then maybe kill the cue there and shoot the four ball down with the 7 9 now. I think that's what he's looking at. That's what he's going to attempt. Yeah, I think that's what he's looking at. Hit it pretty strong. Nope. He hit that really strong. Well, it's an open shot for Jason. Uh, whether he wants to play it into the side pocket, cut, you know, back cut it, or play it into the corner, I think he's going to elect to play it into the back cut. 
Yeah, I think he, 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 like you said earlier, he back cuts the balls very well. He holds the rock really tight to the angle. Yeah, I think I like him playing in the side as well. He could roll it into the corner, too, though. Mm. Now, he's got a cushion, and the five being where it is, he's just got to be careful. He's queuing that up to play it inside. Yeah, sure he did. just hits it that way. He hits him. Got to get out, though. Uh, he's close. It's okay. ah, he's got an angle. He's good. He's okay. Six That's to the seven is crucial. He's got to get the cue ball up around that spot area where that seven is yep. so that he can have the possibility of making it. I... So the five to the six and then to the seven. Yeah, I think he, I think he's right in line to do that. I think Jay already knows. See where he is? Going. Yeah, absolutely. Seven yeah, ball. he already knows. Coming right back to the middle. Yep. Yeah, he's... He's really struggled for a while, and he has been all weekend. He's definitely the odds-on favorite. Kevin Creme de la Creme Boulet. Boulet. That, that's his, uh, he's got the photo ops going on. We try to open my eyes. I need two That's picks. Mikey DeMarco right there, and he, uh, he's a very good, uh, tournament promoter. Yes. He does, uh, ship in, it. Yeah, ship the cash Saturdays on, uh, uh, on Saturdays in Rhode Island, uh, he changes the oh, venue Jason from week the eight to week. Ball. Oh, he did hang. That, that's huh? some tournament. You know, he was explaining the tournament to me. Is like uh, on a break and run, you got to say ship the cash. Ship the cash. Yeah, real and, loud. And, and there's a pot. Yeah. There's a lottery pot. Al, it's a very good. Yeah, tournament, he, actually. he was explaining it to me. I like the format. It's pretty cool. It's like a race to two. It's a race to two. Alternate any, break. Alternate break. Any skill levels allowed, pro down to the, right. uh, yeah. To and you the, can buy back. And you can buy back. And when your buyback fee is based on your uh, your ranking. Right. So the. Could be anywhere from right $20 to $30. Right. The buyback matters. The handicap doesn't matter because everyone's playing to race to two. But when you want to try to get back in, if you got knocked out, then your handicap comes from the play. Right. Yeah, and it's a good... It's it a sounded good, really nice, the way he was explaining it to me. Yeah, it's actually really interesting. And then there's a lottery where he has uh, tokens to go, uh, you know, $5 a person to, to shoot the break and run. And then it's a crewing pot. So if nobody hits it that week, you get it the next week. And it's a... a it brings a lot of action, it brings a lot of fun, and it brings a lot of cool shoes there. There it is, St. Patty's Day. Be right here at Snickers. The official drink is Jameson. Let's get shamrocked right here at Snickers. Sean Wilkie trailing by one. He is the gentleman in the hot seat. Went undefeated through the tournament. Jason Shaw in the... B side of the chart has to beat him twice. True double elimination. Races to nine. Yes, and uh, Sean actually put Jason on the lose side. Yeah, he shot so real well. Yeah, so real these guys well. have already played. Uh, in fact, Jason came up to me. He said, Al, you know, he looked at me like, what, what just happened? I said, well, look, the guy shot really well. That's what happened. Um, but, you know, you can see it. He's, he's going to blow. He blew that off already. You know, he's just going to play his game. And that's going to have to beat him about, twice. That's what's great about a bullet shooter. It's always about what what next game can I play. Yeah. <laughs> Basically what it's like. <laughs> you got to step out. All right, Kevin's going to step out. We'll have him back as soon as I'm he... I'm not uh, going to step out unless you want me to step out. No, I just don't, I don't want... I don't know what kind of conversation we're going to want to hear, so that's why I muted I muted it. Kevin is back on the air. Yeah, that was just a real good friend of mine from uh, Taunton, Mass. He, he's a good pool player. He just wanted to know uh, flat. what time it was. You know what time it was. I know what time you it was. You don't sleep on a job. Time. Yeah, it's your time. Well, I know what time it was. That's when they come hunting, though. When it's your time. They'll find you. <laughs> uh. There's Jay. 
Good little top move. Well, he missed ball. the last eight ball and uh, wound up letting Sean back up the box. Yeah, I can't see him doing that too often. And he doesn't do it too often. You see, Jason Shore is going to put his extension on. Yeah, he did it early too. Mucci. Being left-handed from this side of the table, sometimes he just leans over, but, you know, he's got to go over the four ball here. I see him doing the last match. He, it didn't affect him at all. He still struck real true. Yeah. Well, a lot. But he's got to reach over this. Okay. Yeah. That's a tough shot. Very good. Real good. Yeah. Threaded the needle between that six and, and he's seven. He's on the right angle. He's on the right side of the floor ball to get right in the nook and cranny here for the five. Still playing with play. the extension on the back of the queue, too. Yeah, he's going to play right in that little hole for the five ball. I think if he draws the ball out here, he's got a good look at that six anywhere. Looks like he's playing with like Earl Strickland's cue now. But he played it with two rail. Perfect. Great shot. That's a good shot, Al. How he could either draw it back or just keep it right there. I think he's going to just keep it right there. Oh, look at this. Drew it back. The only one that saw that was Jason. <laughs> now it's one stop shopping right now. <laughs> he's good. Continue to play with the extension still on the back of the queue. Yeah, I think Shaw's having fun now. He's 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 really got a feel for the table now. Three to one, Mr. Jason Shore, as Sean Wilkie has just been sitting in his seat, really not doing anything wrong. Uh, just has to sit down and watch uh, Jason control the table. Yeah, he, the only thing he, he, the only mistake he made was in the first rack where he, he missed the one ball that was up table. I stepped and out. Gave, and gave Jay ball in hand, and then since then he really hasn't made any mistakes. It's just Shaw's coming. Right, right. Well, you know, it can just go the other way, too. When uh, Jason sure. missed the eight ball, Sean got up there and uh, won that game. It's only two balls he had to run. But, you know, nevertheless, if Jason steps out of line and does something wrong, Sean, you can bet rest assured, he's going to try to make him pay for it. Yeah, he can. And that's he what he's supposed to do. You know what I mean? Yeah, at, this, uh, at his that's level. the game. Yeah, he can come with four, four, five. Uh, one mistake can cost him three, four. He tried to play that one in the Eight side. Eight ball, climbing the yeah, rail. that's the first ball he's made on the break, and now he might really have a... Uh, yeah, he might really be feeling it right now. They're dressed up, ready to go out. I yeah, he, he, yeah, he might be feeling it right now, because that's the first time he's made a ball on a break. And, and Eagle Eye's ready to hunt. Yeah, he's he's coming. Yeah, he's, he sees it already. They all look like field mice to him. Well, yeah. He, you know, he's you an see, eagle. You can already the eagle see, soaring yeah. down to get the field mice. <laughs> yeah, he's coming. Yeah, right here. Right, right yeah. through him. Nice shot. Yeah. On the bottom rail here. Now, he's a little straight there on the three. But well, he's, he's going to have to go forward here or just draw back and accept the long shot on the four. I think he's going to spin it. Yeah, he's going to go forward and play it in the opposite corner. Yeah, he's going to spin it. He, he, he's been doing that. I've seen him do it all, all weekend. Jason is on a mission. Yeah, he's he's really bearing down. I didn't mean to get it on his bad side. No, you didn't get it on his bad side. You think, I mean, you, you were barking. That's all. I have to bark out. Yeah, you didn't get on his bad side. Nine. He's a pro. He's, he's heard uh, a lot of things. I in think his, so. His travels, trust oh, me. Oh, I would hope so. Yeah. Uh, Kevin was the one uh, barking in the background of <laughs> when we heard the uh, commotion go on. He was that guy. <laughs> I am that guy, Al. He is that guy. I'm not a bad guy. No, no. I am that guy. Just slide across the table. Yeah. Play the nine in the bottom right. Look at how he studies his cue. Uh, Great shooter. Just they such a you know, they both are. Stroke. I like Sean and I like Jason. You know? They're both great shooters. They wouldn't be in this position in the finals if they weren't, right? I mean, let's just uh, put the facts on the table. They have good players in this tournament. And Jason says, well, I'm going to put down another one. It's 4-1. And as, and as my buddy Billy would say, he would say. Uncle Billy? 
Oh, BTK, you okay. would say. <laughs> the, the kid would say, put that in your musket. Oh, that's who texted me yesterday. I couldn't figure it out. BTK, I couldn't put it together. And you know how many times I heard that? Billy the Kid, BTK. Oh, that's my I got buddy. a text on my phone, and I gave a shout-out to BTK. Come on. And Mama. They were yeah. watching. <laughs> And Mama was watching yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I love them. But he said, "Mom, he said, Mama and I are sitting here. I'm sorry, Billy. That's Billy. I couldn't put the BTK together. Yeah, I was like, I, I was about to text back, who is this? And I was too embarrassed. That's good. Billy the kid. Now I know. Okay. All right, we're going to put Kevin back on air. As he had to take care of the waitress, wanted to know if he wanted an extra sandwich for a friend of his, and he was going to pay for it. And Kevin said, absolutely. If he's That's hungry, it. if he's hungry, I'm buying. He needs extra mayonnaise. <laughs> Here we go. Watch the two ball. Clean ball. Yeah, two ball right ball. into the court. Always. He's been, he's he hasn't been made it in a while. He hasn't made it. The, the, the last rack he did, the first two he didn't. That's now he's really hitting him. The shot on the one is not there. He's got to play a, either a one seven combination or bank the one ball to the short rail and back down to the other side. What do you think he ball. does, Al? I think he's going to get aggressive. He's going to play the one seven combination. So you know, too. he wants to stay in control I, I, of the rock. I, I think I agree with you. I, I, I would do it too. Oh, fired it. He did. Oh, he got a little weird there. A lot weird. Yeah, that that one froze right up. I think on the fall ball. Okay. Yeah, I think it's froze right up there. The thing about it is he's gonna have to kick at it. He needs a rail. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wait a minute. He can see this, and he's looking at the oh, five towards the side us. pocket. He saw it. Yeah, but the cue goes Isn't right that in the corner. Four balls moving on the table. The only one that goes in is the white one. Right. Figure that out. I've done it a lot. <laughs> Everybody has. Yep. And now Sean's Thank gonna you, take a look at if he can bear down here and get out. We gotta, we gotta match. Like I said, the first time I met Sean was probably about ten years ago, and uh, I seen him on a bar box table, and I couldn't believe the action this guy was getting. And I just. I'm an affinity to action. I, I, I walked over and said to him, hey, how you doing? And the kid just kept getting out. Rack after rack after rack. And I, and and now, still to this day, I, I love watching him shoot pool. I love the way he grinds. I love yeah. the way he moves he with cue ball. Yep. I just like the way he does business. And we're friends to this day. And I, I am really rooting for him. I really am in his corner. So there is let let let, let no mistake. <laughs> it be is made. America. Don't worry. Yeah, you let can no root mistake you be made. I'm rooting for Sean Wilkie. <laughs> so, well, does does he play the uh, six nine combination? I don't roll think back he up? plays it. I don't think he plays the six but, nine. Well, no, I really don't. Not if, it, if it's easy box, enough, I don't think I don't think he does it. No. I don't think he does. Well, he plays the six in the side and rolls up. I just. My left hand right there. Kevin's off to the side talking to a couple of folks approaching their booth. They want to take pictures of him as he's got the headset on. Man, I know. I got Kevin muted right now because he was off to the side talking. All right, here we go. He's back. Right, nice Sean. shot. Yeah, that's a great shot from Sean. He is a shot maker. He, like you said earlier, Al, he didn't, he didn't just slump his way here. This guy, right? No, this he's a shooter. Uh, everybody knows Sean Wilkie. <laughs> yeah. Not only in the nine ball, not only in ten ball, he plays a great game of street pool. Also, uh, good friends with uh, Mikey Fingers, aka uh, Fingers, Mike Badstubner. Down in Long Island, I love it when I have, uh, you know, like when I'm doing a straight pull event. I don't see the patterns the way that these guys do. I right. mean, these guys just see it, and they just see numbers and. Right. 
and they do it, you know. And so I like having Sean and Mikey Fingers in the booth doing some commentating because these guys, especially Sean, uh, he's got some real deep insight into it. But Mikey also does, and they fit together like a glove. Yeah. It's like a Molinari glove. Right, right, right. I mean, these guys really do it. Hey. Four to two. That's a big game. Four to two. Now, what do you what do you think about the rack? I think it's a beautiful rack. I mean, it's, that's a house rack, right? That is one of the house racks. Yeah, right. Now, what do you think about the? Uh... If you're going to ask ask me a question where it's going to get controversial, I stay out of drama. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well then, I think it's a great rack. Then we'll go over here. We'll say, <laughs> "Come on, Sean." No, I try to stay out of that. I try to stay out of the controversy. Well, I seen, so. I seen a cup. Yeah. All right. Okay. 1750 for first place, I believe. Uh, somebody has the name Jason Shore. S H O R E. Here we go for the break. Watch the five. Didn't go. But everything ran up table. That's for sure. We're gonna see a little safety play here. You have the three, six, and seven. Bank the one down table and try to duck the cue ball behind the machine gun shot here. I think so. I think that's the play. He's going the other way with it. Five ball. You're going to try to duck on the five? No. Just played the bump. Played it well, too. It really did. Sean can kick the one. Utilize the four ball to... Yeah. Kevin's back. All right. Well, yeah. Sean kicked the ball, but I, I mean, it, it was kind of a real defensive <laughs> position there. And he didn't advance his position, and now Jason's going to bear down on this one and probably take control of the rack. Yeah, I think he won the safety wall there, Al. Could have got a little funky right there, though. Could have. Three ball goes in the... Uh... Excuse me. Right. I don't know what's in that glass. It got right in my sinuses. Uh, the six, seven are wired, so to say, so that's no worry. Yeah, and he looked at it too, Al. Yeah. I got a long drive. There you go. I'm going home. Uh oh. Careful here. He's all right. Well, you don't want to get too straight and throw it back so it's a side pocket. But I, the way his body language is, yeah, he's okay. Yeah, I think you know, he's, he's going to stun good, it right there. He's got to get good shape on that 6-7. Oh, well, he drew it way back. Well, because of the shape on the 6-7. So he wants to get real good on it, yeah. Well, he's going to get real good on it here because he's going to line up right where his cue is. I'd say right out that first diamond, he's going to line up. Yep. Oh, Jason does have his own line of cues. You're right, Troy. Really? Oh, yeah, he's got his own. Mucci makes uh, Jason sure a cue, yeah. I think he's got... Oh, three, he, four, that, he didn't hit that good out. Well, that's that's the problem. He mushed it. That, 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 that cue ball rolled right into that six. And now I'm not he's, sure how many models. I think four different models of cues. Uh, of the cues that he does he custom name. build them or uh, have yeah, a custom Bob Mucci. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe. Hey, if you want to leave somebody, this is the way you want to leave them here. Well, he left them on the bottom rail, but to just get back at the table, Sean's looking at it and he's not happy, but at the same time, he's just happy to be up there. You know, the guy's up on you four to two, all right, and you're faced with this. And notice the direction of the cue ball could scratch off the nine ball yep. if he fires at the six in the corner pocket, and he just took a good look at that. I would take another lap around the table, Al. If I was him, I would take another lap. Nothing's going to change, though. No, I get and it. Those balls are going to remain the same, unless there's some kind of earthquake that blows into town. Then it I might would take another lap. Take another lap. Maybe. I don't blame you, too. I mean, I would. Know. I would take another lap. 
Well, what do you do here? Do you bump the do you, do you bank the stick do? towards the right-hand corner with enough speed so that if you miss it, it comes back out towards the center of the table and bring the cue ball up you, by the eight? You I mean, can't you know, commit. I don't. You got to watch that nine ball. It's, I don't think you can commit to really force following that six all the way in the corner. I think you well, have Lucci, to find he's gonna a fire way. At it. You think he's going to fire? Yeah, he's got to. Then he has to really commit to that stroke, stay he's down. going for it. And then just then let the chips fall where they may if he's going to stroke that. Yeah, he fired at yeah, it. Yeah, let the chips fall where they may if he's going to fire that shot. And he's on the bottom rail out. Side pocket. There's nothing really good you can do there. It was a tough shot. Yeah. Very tough. Now, Jay, Jay he's in a... He's in a... Two ball back up and down. He can do a couple If you think you're going to think, cut it. Yeah, that's possible. It looks like he's going to play it all the way up, too. He's thinking about it. <laughs> he is. We got SC5 in the chat. What's up, SC5? He says, shoot it and crush your fingers, he says. <laughs> yeah, hit it hard and hope. And Shaw just missed that one because that's yeah, And then he got a good roll. He did. Yeah, he got a real generous roll there. And, and no. the look on uh, Sean's face is like, I can't yeah, believe yeah. this just happened to me. It's all right. It's all part of the game. That's it's, uh, it. The rolls go both ways after a while. Of course. I don't know any pool player that hasn't gotten a roll. That's for sure. And it's how you deal with them. Well, it's how you deal with them. You you, you, deal with you, them. You, you keep, keep your professional attitude, stay down, to. bear down, keep you playing the game, or do you quit? And, no. and, and this kid, there's no quitting, Sean. There's no quitting in either one of them. That's for sure. He's faced with another kick. I mean, he could keep the cue ball up there. He wants to get the six somewhere behind the nine area down on that other short rail. Yeah, ship it down table. Got to hit it harder than that, I think. Yeah, go. Well, I think he left the eagle on the out. And, and if anyone's going to shoot this shot, it's Shaw. He's shooting at it. He's firing it. Oh, and he missed it. Oh. He fired at it, and he uh, he missed it. Relax. He got you. Kevin's uh, having a couple of cocktails. He's he's of age, believe me when I tell you. He's of age and he works hard for a living. Uh, so he, uh, he's having a couple of cocktails. You're right, guys. But you know something? He's great company. They pick you up. They nailed you to the wall in the chat. Not, we don't have we don't have dumb listeners. <laughs> no, no, we got good people in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I bet you they would have a good time if they came here. Oh. Oh, I'm looking at that all the way on the rail. That's tough. He's jacking up. That's such a tough shot. That pocket is tough, too. Yeah. He missed it. Well, but he missed it he missed good it so far. Well. So far. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know. Mr. See. Wilkie cannot believe it. He can't believe what's yeah, sure. happening. Sean's just shaking his head. He can't believe how good this guy misses. <laughs> I don't well, like the hat. It's all part of the game. I oh, told you I don't like the that's hat. That's a signature series. That's his That's his hat. That's his hat? Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, he's all got right. all different kind of caps that he wears at different events. Come on. That's his signature. All right. I'm going to have to get on board if I want to be a fan, right? If you want to be a fan, you got to get on board. Absolutely. I buy think the I'm, stock. I'm going to have to purchase one. Buy stock when they first start. Go public. Sean Wilkie going to fire at the sixth ball. I think so. Oh, is he banking it? No, I think he's he going to bank it. Bank shot. Wow, what a, how'd he hit it? He hit it real good. Real good. Oh, look at the cue ball. 
Wow. Yeah, that's that a, cue ball just never stopped rolling. That's, a, that's one of these things in the pool world. Wow, it's, it's just a tough, a tough roll. I don't, I can't even explain table one. I don't even know. That's a, that's a bad roll. And what Jay a shot just, he came with. And then Jay just finishes out what he should do. He cleans up the work. Five to two. Five to two. Sure. Mr. Sean Wilkie gets up there and banks that six straight back. Yeah, hit it good. Hit it real and well. scratched. Didn't hit a rail. That six went right in the hole. Never hit a rail. Perfect. Yeah, table one's real gaffy. It's got it's got bumpy rails. And Definitely didn't deserve it. Definitely yeah. didn't deserve that. But you know that's pool. Jason's up five to two. It's a race to nine. It's not over, and it's a true double elimination. And you know what? If Jay wins, they do it again, Al. Yeah. 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 I'm here. I'm camped out. Where are we going? Where am I going? Right. Where am I going? Good stuff. Here we go. Yeah. Watch the seven. Well, he's 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 two for one. He, he, I think he's two for uh, two for four. Wow! Breaks. What kind he of a break, break was that? He saw break them. What are we playing one pocket? And he saved himself on the eight ball. He saw break them now. He's looking at it. He's kicking out it. He's not playing. Yeah, he's not playing push. I like the way he kicked, though. You know, he kicked to try to kick safe. He wanted, if he didn't feather the ball, the other ball there, that cue ball was coming down. Coming that in the rack, yeah. you know, behind the, right. yeah, behind the eight nines. I like the, I like the kick. Yeah. Again, Sean out of the seat and faced with this. Well, he's looking at it. I mean, if he really plays the one and pockets it, I mean, two rails, he's behind all the action. Yeah, but he's got to come with the shot. Yeah, that's that's big because he's jacked Getting up over the seven. the cue ball seven. down there is only half of it. Yeah, coming with the shot. Yeah, he's jacked up over the seven. Al, is Kevin a prison god in Mass or Rhode Island? Because my friend is a prison god. In Concord, Mass. I plead the fifth. I don't know. I usually don't tell people to say what your occupation is on the air. Um, so I don't think Kevin is going to say what his occupation I believe he's a telemarketer. I am a he bus sells, driver. He's a bus driver and a telemarketer. Absolutely. He sells casino stock. <laughs> hey, we were doing good last week, Al. <laughs> <laughs> no, I really don't give that anybody's occupation, honestly. Sean comes with it, and he might get snook at He's married. Shot. He's married up to the oh, four man, ball. He don't like it. Came Did with a see great that shot. Reaction? Oh, it was priceless. He rocked his head. Oh, and I like the Nas little cut he's got in his face. Just has to touch the rail. He's not going to hit this hard. Just bring the two to the I rail. Mean, That's it. And we're going to have a little uh, pit pat not, going on. He's still not happy about that, Al. No, of course not. The two ball's going to sit halfway underneath the four, and the cue ball's going to go up table here. Or just towards the left nah, long rail. Exactly. You know? He's throwing it. Just completely. to duck him. Just get past yep. that side pocket, yep. though. I agree. Well, looking at it. Exactly, Foxy. Oh, oh. He's, he's playing something crazy. He's gonna he make played it. Played the combo. Honey, honey. That's interesting. Like, do you play? The, has, do you play the one pocket shot, or do you play the well, carom? That's, I think that's what he. He's an imaginative. I like, don't know. I like playing the carom here, but you got to watch well, yourself. Here, I play the one pocket shot, but he's gonna play the carom. He's ducking. No, he played the one pocket shot. He's that's ducking. a good one. Well, Doc, we have to, uh, Sean, Sean, when, yeah, when, when one guy goes different, you got to go different. Now he's stuck with kicking at it. One rail? You, you heard me mention something earlier? Oh, about Kevin? Oh, yeah, this is a, a big pool room. There's plenty of Kevins here. <laughs> plenty of mics. <laughs> plenty of owls. A lot of us. <laughs> A bunch of us. A lot of us. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
It's tough to finish out though. Okay. Comes back into the problem, but he froze up on a five. I don't understand that one. Well, he's gonna kick this one in way up table, long rail, come on back down. And the fives right where it is is making it a little bit easier because you don't have to do too much with the rock. It's a big shot. That's how That's it looks a when great you make it. Shot, yeah. man. Yeah. And on the six is still locked. Go get a little your extension. Bit. He's got a decent angle too, man. Got to go back and get his extension. These guys are in a dog fight. Well, Jason has to beat him the first set to force it into a true double, you know. He knows it. Sean knows it for sure. Sean doesn't even want to go into a double. But no way. At this point here, you know, Jason in control of the table, there's nothing really you can do about it. Just hope you get an opportunity. And he tries and to shot. freeze him on the seven, and he didn't. That's funny how that... Cue ball didn't spin behind that seven. He had a lot of spin. You know on what that. I mean? He yeah. wanted to lock him up. You know that, Al. Right. All right. So Sean's up here. He's got to look. You, you don't bank it, do you? No, and Sean, I don't know. He he banked that six so I, well. You know. I, honestly, I know. I'm I'm just gonna sit back. I like safety here. I do but, too, uh, but I'm just gonna watch the pro. You know. There it is. That's a safe. Watch the point. Oh my God, he got oh, got unlucky there. Yeah, he wanted to come here. All right. Well, Jay comes up. Yeah, he wanted to come here. He wanted to come back behind the nine eight cluster. Right. Jay's looking at it. Now he's real calm. He's straight on this ball, but I think. Well, a six ball what position. What angle is he looking at to play safe on to freeze him on the eight? Well, he's trying to figure out how he can get the cue ball behind the short side of the to six make to it? play the six in the side pocket. Either way. Even, I don't think that he can play the six in this side, but I no, think he, he can play it in the left-hand side. And even if he gets off angle at any point, he can freeze him on the eight. Yeah, but he, he wants to run out. You can rest Oh, absolutely. Short. But he's he's gonna play the sure. he's gonna play the freeze to run out. Yeah. Well, he's gonna make it. No way. I don't, I don't, even I don't know. think he can make it. Watch the hit. Yeah. Well, Sean's right there, and everybody's watching this because it's the finals. So. It's well, a good he banked hit. it and yeah. he missed it. Oh wow! That's he a sellout. He opened the table up like a flower now. Yeah, that's a sellout. Oh, why would he do that? Sean's got to take time because he's on the rail here. Yeah, now he's going well, to have he's, to... Yeah, go yeah ahead. He's on the rail, and it's almost a force three rail shot. He's really got to force it. He might be as straight as we... You know, we're not really seeing it right. You know, this is what he's faced with. That's he's got to get all the way... He's straight. Up. What do you do? It's hard to cheat these pockets. You I can can't cheat much. the side, especially here on table one. The, you can cheat it to the inside of each corner, but you cannot cheat the side. Oh, that's a tough look. He hasn't, Sean, been, he hasn't been getting the best of them. But either way, I, I respect this kid, and he's going to make a good decision regardless. That cue ball is going to turn over like you never saw. He's going to be jacking, he's up. jacking up a little bit. Yeah, he's jacking up. He's going to spin it. Oh, how'd he hit it? He turned it over. Oh, right. how'd he hit it, Al? How do you hit it, Al? Hit it good. Real How do you hit it, Al? Real good. Real good. Easy, pal. Easy in the booth. Like easy. <laughs> Kevin's getting crazy. I ain't getting crazy. He's, he's got a. He's got a little. I'm rooting for my boy. All right. All right. Uh, the whole room likes. Well done, Sean. That was a good out. 5-3 and breaking. Pretty impressive. So he can turn it over here. He can get a B&R out of this. If he can. 
if he can. You He's know? on the table at least. Yeah. And that's all. Anybody rooting for him can help for. Sean's break's been pretty good. He usually moves the nine towards the pockets. Solid break. Yeah, and he usually likes flirting with that nine early. Different from a lot of pros. Two ball, uh, down and the he, side. And, then he, <laughs> and, he and made, that's easy to do in nine. He ball. made whitey. You know, if, if you don't hit him square and plant that cue ball and come off a little bit to the left or the right, that cue ball can't find that side pocket. Uh, I don't really see where J Jason Shaw gets <laughs> tangled up. I mean, I really don't see where he, there's anything in this pattern that... Easy E, he hit it real good. Yeah, I really don't see anything in this pattern that, that, sh that rattles Jason. That he hasn't seen before. Now, this is a thin one. But he makes this. That's clear, clearly past the four ball. <laughs> and he's he's going to settle right under that. Yeah, I don't see a problem here. And, and, and what's funny is once you solve the problem as a pool shooter, to stay down and bury every shot. And the way this this man in his stroke is so consistent, that's yeah. what's impressive. That's what's that's what's that's what separates the professionals from the amateurs. I don't think he hit it enough. Oh yeah, he did. He Boy, got that, it that good. Ball came he off got it night. good. He he knows this table now. He's 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 running. He's trying to win it. Do you go with reverse here? Yeah, or run it. Go he's gonna run it. He's gonna run it. He's gonna run around. He's he's having fun. He'll run this one around. Uh, he, he cinched that one. But <laughs> yeah, he cinched that one, but well, Jason is having fun here. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's 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 his tournament to lose and the only one that's gonna take it away from him is Sean Wilkie. 6-3, folks, in favor of uh, Jason Shore. It's the first one to nine, but if Jason gets there, it's a true double elimination, just in case you're signing on. And Jason would have to beat Sean one more time, as Sean is undefeated uh, through the tournament, through the field, and was in the hot seat. We still have uh, railbirds hanging out, and I'll tell you what. If this goes into a true double, we could be here to 1.30 in the morning, believe easy. it or not, on the East Coast. It's 11.42 right now. Oh, yeah, it's probably going that way out. Yeah, it's probably going that way. Unless, unless Sean can hit a gear. <laughs> here we go. Yeah. Looking for the four ball. He's two for the five. Right. Uh, I think he's three. Man. I think he's two for five or three for five. He's crushing he's him. Two ball. <laughs> Look, there's ten balls moving around the table in different directions. The white ball comes up and finds a hole. Both guys did it in conspiracy, right, they Mary? They Mary Kinnison's in the chat. They reciprocated. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Uh, I don't see. I don't see. Mary. If, all ten balls moving around the whole table, and the cue ball finds pocket. Yeah, it's the only one. See, Sean bumps that. I don't, I don't find a problem with that, but he just made that a real close angle. Well, now he's looking at the two, and I, I, I see what he's looking at because if he cuts it too thin. Does he bump it in the four and play the three here? What? 
got to play the two ball. Well, look at how close the three eight off. No. Oh. Did you bump it in the four ball? Well, or he, he, play can, a he, he can move the cue ball. Uh, Where? He, well, he can move the cue ball up and down table if need be. You think he does that? But, you know, the shot with the stretch, I don't know, you see? That's what I'm saying. He's got to, he's got to stretch over that whole corner. That's a tough shot. Spin I don't it. think you're going to see him slow roll this. I think no, he's gonna I, I, he's going to hit it. I think he hits it into the four ball. Oh, he passed the four ball, and then he got locked by a five. He did try to hit the four ball. Yeah, you got to hit the four ball there. Ah, good try, Sean. But now he's buried, and he's going to have to kick. He already knows the kick. Ah, I, I think like him. Now he's locked. Good shot, Sean. Can you look at it? Oh, yeah. Jason can he, he see can that. See Jason can see that. I can see it. Sorry. Yeah. No, no, you're good. You're good. You're having a good time. It's, it's quite all right. Little, it's quite all right. Like a little... I'm taking the back pro seat. I'm show on there. Take a little pro <laughs> show on there. It's all right. Man. Man, this kid is so good. Look at... And he's... He just, it doesn't, there's not a shot in the game that this kid can't see. Look at him settle. Oh, a little weird there, but. I think he should have punched it a little bit more and just matter. come back out. Well, it does matter for, like, lower level players. But how he hits this ball, that's so straight. Yep. Right there comes one round. Do you think he bumps in the seven or plays behind it? That's the bump into it, right? And now well, he lost he just it. Did. No, yeah, he didn't now lose he got it. weird. He's still in it to win it. Nah, he's blazing Side pog and he comes around. Yeah, he's that good. He can do a million and one things. Yeah, he's just that watch good. the scratches is what he's gonna watch out for. Okay. He should be okay. Yeah, exactly. You can't pattern this guy. Okay. He has a gear that no other pool player has. Hey, we understand uh, Scotland just sent us a text. We Scotland? Understand. Yeah, Jason's family is uh, online him. watching it. I need scotch. <laughs> <laughs> Seven to three. <laughs> Kevin says, tell the family I need scotch. <laughs> uh, wow. <laughs> He's still sharp as a tack. <laughs> <laughs> Your son is a phenomenal pool player. Said in Scotch. <laughs> Want to say hello to Charlie Shore and Natalie and the Hi, whole Charlie. crew? Uh, love. I would love to. I, I, hey, I saw the Shaw family in here. They they had the walker in here. The white was in here. He said hi to the little one. Yeah. No disrespect. Love no. him. Yeah, sure. I'll give him a hug. Big, big bear hug. If I could. Yeah, yeah Ari, I can't. Ari's here. I don't know yeah, if they went back to the room. Right? I don't know if they were... Oh, they were all here. They were eating dinner and everything. Yeah, yeah I mean, I don't know where she is right now. I don't know if she's back at the room or sitting in the car giving the baby a nap, so to say. This, this beer is to them. Nah, I like... Man, I've seen them. They're great. Stepping out? Oh. I thought you were stepping out. I will if you want me to. No, I thought you were stepping out to uh, make a delivery. I'm telling you, I saw it. It's a whole family over there. Yeah. yeah. Headset back on. Huh? How are you going to navigate a plane without that headset on? Well, well listen, I'll navigate the plane. Nah, I, I respect the whole Shaw family. Seen them all here today. Well, had a good time with them. Mr. Wilkie is, uh, he's got a little pep in his step, but oh, yeah, you know, it's 7 3. It's still not over. He, he would love to get a couple of break and runs, at least get out of this rack and, and get back in this game. Three ball. He plays one rail right behind the floor. Nice shot, Sean. Hey, he's ready. He's, oh, he's up. And I was, um, I was actually just talking to the wait staff here at Snuggers, which is world class. 
Oh, absolutely. Yeah, they take care of you. You come down from out of town. All the girls here that work here are like threes on a scale of one to ten compared to Vegas. Vegas? Look, <laughs> Kevin just looked at me like I had two heads. He's like, where did he come up with that number? Yeah, I'm only well, kidding. I was like, how many beers did you have? Like, <laughs> None at all. These that girls you can are bet beautiful. On. <laughs> Overran it. He's going to get too low on the seven ball. Yeah, he did. He, he gassed that draw, huh? Not only that, he almost went into the pocket. Overdrew it. Yeah, he cast that. Well, so I was looking at it, you know, like it. It was funny. <laughs> it's, I love, I love his swagger. He's going to hit this well. I know he's going to hit this well, Al. Hmm, he went for it. I know the guy. And I know when I see that on his face, I know he's going to go for it. And he almost made the ball. So now Jay's left with the 7, 8, 9. But he's on the rail. He's out. It's a hard shot. He can come with him. You know, he likes long distance. He's got that eye. Yep. Shot. Wow, he made it look so smooth. Yeah. You know how hard that shot is? You yeah, do. Not for him. Him, it's just cake. Frosting. Yeah, it's look I mean, at that. Dude. It's unbelievable how well he shoots those long distance stroke. shots. But I think that goes back to playing on like a six by twelve or something. I mean, Jason Shore to the hill in the first set, on the verge of making this go into a true double. And they're playing for a little, little decent, little decent amount of money. I think it's seventeen fifty for first place, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, decent prize pool. Yep. Paying down to 16 places. They I got good looking trophies over there. Oh, Steve and Regina always uh, first yeah. class. Yeah, first class. Absolutely. Beautiful trophies. 8 3, Mr. Jason Shaw. Where's Jason from? Glasgow, Scotland. Watch the nine, it counts on the break. Mm, I mean, again, that's, that's like. It's the third work. time, fourth time he's come up dry. I want to say third. Workable. It's workable. Hey, I think I think Sean's out, but hmm, that's that's for a different discussion. Well, five balls really not too much of an issue up there by the six. He does have to go from the four to the five, which is the four is down at the opposite side of the table, just below the three there by the short rail. And uh, probably go one rail or two rails back up for the five. Right now he's looking at. He's straight there, but I think he's out. I think he gets right here. Yeah, he wants to get just about where the head spot is. Yeah. You know, a little bit favoring the left side. Yeah, he can throw it right behind the seven and get right there. Well, he's got to get as straight as possible on the five to hold a cue for the six. Oh, he went weird. Oh, what a spin. You know, mm, now it's a little even more difficult. Yeah, it's a little more difficult. He's going to take the six Up and with down. him. And try to take the six with him. Oh, he and banked he it and duck. freezed him. Nice shot. That's a good shot. Al, we're looking three shots in advance, and that kid made a good play there. All right, good guys. Shot. All right, the majority wins. We're going to say uh, to Kevin, thanks for sitting in. And um, we appreciate it. Uh, Kevin, thanks once again. He, Kevin's uh, beverage just arrived, and he's got a party to attend to. Kev, thanks for sitting in for a little while. Love to see you, Appreciate now. it. Always thanks, love you. Pal. Love you, too. Hope to see you at every stop. All right. All right, Kevin is stepping out. Thank you, Kev. Jason making the six balls got a shot for the side pocket. Just follow up and play the eight in the opposite side. Man, this is he's gonna get above the nine, I think, and shoot it in the longer corner pocket at the bottom left at this angle. Sure does. And Jason Shore on the verge of forcing this into a true double elimination against Sean Wilkie. 
coming from the whole field being undefeated. That's the first set. 9-3. They're going to gear up. It looks like uh, Sean's going to take a, a quick break here. But uh, Jason Shore now playing even. One race to nine for all the enchiladas. Looks like Jason's going to take a little break himself. So I'm going to step out just for a sec, guys. We'll be right back. Thank you for uh, all your support. Everybody that's modding. And Jarrett, what are you doing down there? Jarrett must be watching on his device. No one Jarrett, he's got all those devices hooked up. I'll be right back, guys. We're going to let this sit right where it is. I'm just going to change the score. Back to zero. You know what? I think I got a few minutes. I might as well sit in here and thank the sponsors because they deserve all the recognition. We do. We did mention the finger bridge. It's, the, it's been uh, studied and practiced with. Uh, controls your cue stick if you use an open bridge. It's good for youngsters that are, use, that are using an open bridge. It keeps the stick from moving back and forth. Kind of gives you that muscle memory to keep that stick straight. You can also jack up and shoot over a ball and jump a ball. Fingerbridge.com. And there it is. Joel Pope down in Mary's neck of the woods. He's got the tip tool. It's the Last Forever tip tool. You go to lastforever.com. Mention Upstate Al 20 and receive a 20% discount right now. I don't know how long that 20% discount is going to last. If it's just for the tournament, Joel and I haven't spoken about it. Uh, Greg Antonakis, get your Southwest from the best. American Q Pickers, there's his telephone number. Contact Greg at ga9ball at gmail.com. Both players ready to rock and roll. Sean Wilkie will have the first break. Who would win? I'm not drinking. I'm uh, I'm on water, and that's about it. Once in a while, I will have like a cup of wine or something, you know, just to mellow out. Mellow out when you're on the road and doing a lot of work, and you're going back to the hotel. A cup of wine's not too bad, just to settle in. But, uh, no, I don't like uh, drinking to the point where I forget where I left my left shoe. But Kev, you know, he's of age. He's allowed to have a couple of cocktails. Let him enjoy himself. He's a really nice guy, too, by the way. All right. Off that subject, back to the game. Serious action right here.
Nice touch by Jason right there to get back on that five ball. You know, he's such in a mellow rhythm right now. We're used to seeing him in a real fast rhythm, getting set before the cue ball comes to rest. It is late. It's been a long couple of days. Uh, no, no. Jared's got a point. I did have uh, not yet a normal granddad's root beer once before here at Snooker. I had a couple of them, and gee whiz, those things are brutal. Jason Shore. Shore's first blood, one nothing. But uh, yeah, like New Jersey pool player says, I have to drive. And I won't do that. Not even one glass. I got my son with me, too. I'm, Many years ago, when I was by myself, I, I, you know, might have tried it, but not worth it. Don't do it. Jason Shore set to break. Set number two. Trying to make that wing ball just not going. Look at this predicament. The one does go, but and you believe it or not, you can hold the cue ball for the two, but the space in between there, it's, it, it's wow. Base, they got something going on with that base once again. He hit it good, but I don't think he made it. It was a good hit on the cue ball. And Sean gets up and he can't believe he doesn't have a shot once again. Most of the time when Sean Wilkie got out of the seat, it was either a very long shot or it was a roll, sort of like this. Because uh, Jason did play that one, and I don't think it's makeable. So there is another roll. Yeah, and after a while, that kind of takes a toll on you, you know, and where you just can't get started. And it's like every time you get out of your seat, you're, you're, you wouldn't mind it if it was a, an intentional safe sort of thing. Like that, that was hit very well. Played safety right there. Mr. Wilkie's going to have to kick two rails behind the one ball. Please have your uh, green cards out. We'll be checking soon. It's too much. Sounds loud in your living quarters where you're at, easy. Turn some of that music down you got in the background. But it's the short side. <laughs> Didn't quite get there, but still makeable. Is the background noise too much? Is that what you're talking about? I can turn it down a little bit if that is too much on you guys. Nice shot, Jay. Oh, 
watch it. Audio was fine. Okay, you guys are good. I'll put it back where it was. Okay. Little cue ball dance here. Two nothing, Mr. Jason Shore. Looking to double dip Sean Wilkie. Sean cannot do anything that actually hurt himself in the first set or the second set. He hasn't had a good look at a, a shot. Uh, Jason's been keeping control, and then many a times when he got out, he was long distance or safe. Uh, Jason Shore playing real strong. And the game that we play, that happens, you know. I'm not counting them out by far. Sure, the two ball this time went into the corner pocket. Two ball gets kicked and a nice shot on the one ball. Wide open. Three ball goes by the eight and the four has a pocket also. I believe the six goes in the same pocket. If not, he'll play it in the opposite corner. Goes in the same pocket. And look out. Here comes Jason Shaw. nothing guys don't forget Mark Dion has his dad's memorial coming up the Robert Dion Memorial Tournament March 12th through the 13th at the Crow's Nest in New Hampshire make sure to check out MD promotions the New England nine ball series that's right around the corner. He also has a tournament coming up in April, April 2nd and 3rd. He'll be at Yale Billiards in uh, Wallingford, Connecticut. So, Wallingford, Connecticut. Check out MD Promotions. Mark's been making things happen and stirring things up in the New England area. And if you want to play, get in touch with Mark right away. Jason says, I want to play. Let's do it. Jason Shore is set to break. He's leading here 3 nothing. Going into rack number four. Uh, this is a, a dangerous position for anybody to be in facing Jason. And when he starts making balls on the break and running, the next time you look up the beads, it might be too late.
Not enough spinach. safe all the way. Very nicely done. Shot. Believe it or not, that seven ball was close. He hit that point a little bit harder, and that seven doesn't have to go. He rocked that point of that side pocket with that seven. But nevertheless, nine ball going down. Mr. Wilkie answering back. 3-1. Let's go Hill Hill. I mean, what better way to end it than go Hill Hill? For the fans. Between these two guys, there's not going to be any balls left on this table by the time they finish this set. These guys are crashing this rack. <laughs> John Wilkie just did a, a Tom Cruise twirl the stick, stab the floor move on its way back to his seat. <laughs> not meaning any disrespect. <laughs> He's, he was doing that to his friend uh, Mitch, who stays with Mitch here in New England. Oh, <laughs> oh, who's Pulsha? Says, I want to sleep. <laughs> Bill Rhodes says, Hill Hill would be nice. Yeah, I like the Hill Hill.
while he's trying to figure out how to get back. He's going to draw or follow. He, I think he's electing to draw this. Oh, he's playing the bank. Did he get the speed? Yes, he did. Probably wanted to come down a little bit more, but he's got a look. Definitely has a look at the two ball. Nice shot, Sean. That's the kind of stuff that'll put you back in the pool room. Start making shots like that. Get your head out of everything else that uh, you might be thinking about. Uh-oh, this could be dangerous. I think he's there. I think he has the shot. Yeah, he does. In trouble and it's spelt pool and where the cue ball is you got to be nine and a half foot tall and wearing spike heels to jump this cue ball over to seven because the cue ball is in the middle of the table yeah. gonna attempt this no I can't see uh, Sean actually attempting this is he Oh, he's kicking. He's kicking in the hole. Did he get in trouble again? Can he get a roll for once in his career? He's laughing like, I got the roll. I think he does have the five. He laughed like, I finally got a roll. He did. That's what he's looking at. He's looking at back cutting the seven. He's undecided whether to play it in the corner or to back cut it into the side pocket. It's like one of those in the middle shots. He cuts it in the corner. He wants to drag the cue ball between, uh, right behind that eight ball. Just missing the scratch and come around and shoot the eight in the side pocket if he plays that in the corner. Shot. He's letting the stroke out. <coughs> Sean Wilkie. Answers back once again. The score is now three to two. He just made a statement. He said, I can dance this cue ball around the table too there, fella. There it goes, guys. Watch the March to the Championship selections right here. Sunday, March 13th at 6 p.m. Order a burger. And a Bud Light and take the glass with you. Also, St. Patrick's Day is right around the corner. Keep in mind, right here is going to be the party at Snooker's. And Sean says, you're right, the party is here and I'm about to break. We're going to get over there and watch them from this angle as the seven almost went in. One ball found the corner pocket, but the cue ball found the side pocket. Ball in hand for Jason Shore to score. Three to two.
Four to the five ball is really the key. Four to the five. And I think he's going to elect to go three rails uh, off the four. In other words, he's, he might catch the rail first and get back up on top of the five to play the five in the same pocket where the four is going to go. But from here, that nine ball is growing. He's got to be real careful that he doesn't get trapped up behind the nine. He might have a change of plan. You know, if he hits it soft, the, not, the five does not go in the upper right-hand corner, whether it goes in the upper left-hand corner. Let's, let's take a look at the overhead. It does go right where he's standing. It looks like it goes right by the nine in that upper corner. Let's see what Jason has in mind. Wow. He drew it back to the open window. What a shot. What a shot. Nice shot, Jason. Just doesn't get any better than that. Four two. up by the one he's got a shot and he's got a shot to dance I thought he would throw it out but he's gonna go forward to hit the six ball but he's got the shot he's got a side pocket shot or he's got a corner cut this young man can make this six ball go just about anywhere he wants but he did come up short on that position and he got back in line that quick that quick he's right back in line Jason Schwartz now leads 5-2. to two. Hey, we want to say uh, keep up to date with AccuStats. Or go over there and uh, take a look at their library. They just uh, finished the DVDs from the last U.S. Open and the Make It Happen. Uh, that took place in the uh, Aramis Simonis Arena in Sandcastles in Edison, New Jersey. That's Mr. Ed Lebowie's pool room. Check out AccuStats. That's A-C-C-U hyphen S-T. ATS.com. Mr. Phil Capel of Billiards Press. Dan Hydrick of Hydrick Custom Cues. 
course, it's a lead sponsor for Mr. Zuglin, Josh Cuse. The Turning Stone Casino Resort in Verona, New York. We're going to be heading there August 25th through the 28th. It's a venue that, if you've never been there, you don't want to miss it. OBQs. Jason said, well, I got my cue in hand. Set the break. He leads. 5-2. ball you can see in the cup right where the five ball is hanging on the shelf look at that five ball in that corner pocket it's like three quarters of the way in the shelf just hanging there trapped up behind the four nine for the three ball You can kick like that, you know, know where you're kicking the object ball at, and knowing the direction of the cue ball is what you want to practice. That's such a big part of the game. Sean let the three ball leak out, but the four ball. about that four ball. It looks like it might be a little too close to the nine. If he can play... Oh, I guess he can play the four into the five. Whoa! Don't get your glasses out, folks. It's the camera. Got a five rate in the base. Yeah, the four goes into the five. Both of them went in the shot on the six ball. Jason Shaw has taken no prisoners. Well, Jason Shaw at six, Mr. Sean Wilkie at two. Sean coming from the hot seat, had to be defeated twice in a true double elimination. Jason has won the first set, forcing this into a double set, and right now leads the second set six to two. Allison Fisher in the chat. Hi, Allie. Everybody else out there. Jason taking a look at it now. Oh. I want to thank uh, the top league, the best amateur league in North America, along with Simona's Cloth and Aramis Balls. Thank you, guys. Both players crashing the pack. And I mean hitting them hard. The four ball fell into the bottom right hand corner. The one is hung up and a shot on it.
Seven to two, Mr. Jason Shore over Sean Wilkie. We're racing to nine for all the enchiladas right here at Snookers. Guys, if you can ever make it to Snookers, this is the place you want to be. Put it on your bucket list. I'd like to thank J&J &J Industries. That's uh, Dana Buffalo's company. He's got all the cleaning tools that you need for your shaft. Also, we want to thank Molinari Glove. MolinariGlove.com. You can see Jason's got it on and had it on all tournament. And he's in the finals. That should be enough to make you buy a Molinari Glove. No, really, support these guys. He's Ira Lee and Eric, I'll tell you what. They sent me messages uh, as we were streaming here, but it was just a little too late for us to actually do it. Uh, the raffle went off already for Mr. Zuglin. But in any case, they're always on board, and they're always doing real well. So if you're in the market for a glove, that's the glove you want. 7-2, to two, Mr. Jason Shaw. Jason Shaw is feeling right now. I'm saying he's going to make this if he goes for the shot. give both these gentlemen credit I'll tell you it's been uh, a long weekend once again it's 12:33 a.m. on the East Coast here uh, these players have been here since 10 o'clock this morning I thought we had a field of 88 somebody told me 98 but I believe it is 88 right now threatening to get up on the hill. And does Jason Shore to the hill in the second set. Sean is doing nothing wrong. Uh, just uh, can't do anything. You know, it's, it's, it's your hands are tied. You got to just sit there and wait it out and hope you get a chance to get back. You know, Sean pushed out, and the way Jason's feeling, you know, he's at the table so long, and he said, I'm feeling good. Let me fire at it. And he did. Seven ball fell into the bottom left-hand corner. It was followed by the six. Again, a shot on the one into the side pocket, but where the two is, I don't know if Jay's going to play it into the side and bump the two. That, that could put the two against the rail unless he completely misses it. Okay, completely missed it. Nice shot. Well, the three ball goes by the five, and the four is a sitting duck. On the side pocket, we might see Mr. Sean Wilkie throw the towel in. I'm not sure. Maybe when Jason gets to the eight, put a position from the five to the eight. But what an exhibition Mr. Jason Shore came with in the second set. And again, Sean did nothing wrong whatsoever. It's just... It's hard to fade this, but he faded it, and he sat there like a gentleman that he is. Went through the field undefeated. Jason Shore takes it down once again at Snookers. Sean Wilkie taking second place. What a great tournament we had, folks, this weekend. If you could make it to the next one, please do so. I'll tell you what, this is one pool room. If you never saw it, you really want to see it. I'm upstate Al of AZB-TV, and really, 
We want to say thank you to everybody that's been helping out. We want to say congratulations to Sean. Congratulations to uh, Jason Shaw. And congratulations to all the sponsors. We hope we helped you out and we did the right thing. Thank you, Mary, and everybody there. You wouldn't believe it unless you witnessed it, right? And I'm glad that everybody was here to do it. On behalf of Snookers, Mr. Mike Zuglin and Josh Tour and the Ray D. Cell uh, Memorial Tournament, I'm going to say goodnight. But I'm going to leave the cameras running until Mr. Steve Golding tells me I can't. Now, we do have the robotics set up this weekend, so you guys are going to get a, a look at, uh, maybe you want a screenshot. There's a Mr. Steve Golding. And of course, you know Sean with the hat and Jason Shaw. Mike Zuglin wants to take a photo op. Here comes the news with their camera. What a light. They got an LED light going. This gentleman with this news camera came in at the beginning of the tournament. Wow. That's some camera. That's a, that'll blind you on the highway. It's like somebody coming at you with the high beams on. He's going to come at the pitch. I don't know if you can see his camera. He's off to your left. Actually, I could move. Hey, we can we can spy on this guy. Look at this. He's got an LED light. Looks like a, a, a truck's headlight or a fog light on a tugboat. <laughs> Watch, he's, he's gonna turn it on. Look at look at the difference. Jason, look at him. The UFC fighter in position. <laughs> well, guys, that uh, is. The end of the celebration as far as the trophies and the photo op. Wait, wait a minute. He's going to take some pictures of Sean. His name is Eric. He is one of the housemen here, one of the uh, general managers, I believe. Well, it's been long. It's been great. It's been great having everybody out there. Jason, congratulations once again, my friend, and you get home safe. I'll tell her I said goodnight and the baby, okay? Yeah, I would imagine. I would, yeah, I would imagine so. <laughs> Take your time, but hurry up. But listen, don't be, uh, she's driving, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, NJ Pool Player says, get me a shirt. Take it easy on me there, buddy. Let me see what I can do. Have a great night, everyone. I'm going to go off. Thank you, Foxy Blue and NJ Pool Player. Uh, guys, you want to learn a few things, go over to AZ Billiards on a live stream link that I posted there and see how many times Foxy Blue actually bumped that post. So she's been working not only here in the chat, but she's been working behind the scenes. And every time you do post on the, one of the live streams that I do post or that anybody does post, it keeps people aware of what's going on. Love you guys. Take care. Jarrett, the jazz man, uh, Ed Ladawi, of course, uh, Allison Fisher, and the rest of the crew that are in. Vicky, Billiards 99, Darren Myers is actually out there, probably fell asleep, and then when I said Allison Fisher's name, he probably woke right up. Petey, see you guys. I'm going to sign off as Mr. Steve Golding's giving me the air traffic controller signal to cut it like in Hollywood put a knife across your, <laughs> your neck <laughs> good night rich thanks for your help buddy
talk to you. Yes, in uh, Brooklyn, don't forget, the 19th through the 20th. I'm trying to go, but I don't want to go, but I got to go. 